Hello, my friends. Welcome to another episode of Build a Myth. My name is Wilfred. So, one great thing about steaming for this game is that every time it's kind of different because the story is randomly generated, focused on the group itself. Um, so, it'll be fun. Uh, I promise you. Now, um, I've uh, started the first game, uh, first attempt, eight hours. Didn't make it. The whole party was wiped. Great story, but it was tragic ending. Um, so I've attempted again another eight hours um, hardcore mode, one save file, no reload. Uh, that went very well. Um, so that was the last couple of videos I showed how the end game was like for the first campaign. So in this video, I'm going to play the um, the new story onto the second campaign. So we have done the Age of uh, Altrix. It sounds like you know um, the Age of Ultron or whatever <laughs> the Marvel world. Uh, the second one is called Enduring War. So and in centuries old wars uh, resurface, bringing with it questions of humanity, identity, and the price of ambition. Um, so there will be a five chapter story again with Mothagi as the main threat. So I don't know how this is going to be like, but uh, I promise you it's, it'll be pretty, it'll be really good. So now um, I am going to randomize the character and I'm going to take it to the beginning of the game. A lot on story this time around because that's how it goes when it starts. Um, because the last couple of the games, there's a lot of comebacks. So I'm trying to balance a little bit here and there uh, to demonstrate a different part of the, uh, the game for you. Um, so yeah, this is basically the second campaign, individual story. You don't have to go do it in sequential manner. The, this one is the easiest and uh, it get you know, harder, I guess. So let's go ahead with it. Um, so I would like to be an adventurer, uh, which is the, you know, the kind of like starting level standard difficulties. You could, of course, make it more difficult as well. I play carved in stone because I like hardcore. I mean, every decision matter. I really hate games whereby I keep reloading and reloading. Of course, the price of it is that I may get defeated, party wipe, game over, but it is what it is, more fun that way. Um, so yeah, let's go. Okay, so this is the map seat. I don't know what it does. It's probably the, uh, the random generator. So I've got like a, a future warrior. Um, Hubert, which is a snacky peacemaker, all right. Uh, future Hunter, which is the decisive uh, Great Wagon, uh, called Song, and a Future Mystic, uh, which is the hot headed coward. Um, so she's a coward, uh, hot headed coward. Well, I mean, I'll accept it as it is, right? Because if you want to really randomize everybody to be a very good positive trait, then what's the point of having a story when everybody is great? So I'll go ahead with uh, the standard randomized stuff and I'll just go for it. <laughs> so let's see, um, again, three classes, um, warrior, a hunter, and, um, and, uh, and, a, and, a, and a mage. 1,000 years earlier, all right, so this is um, Hugh, Hugh Berg. Uh the initial limbs were a success, and I am confident the premise is sound. The thought of that sickness taking you first is too much to bear. Wow, okay. Uh, we can write this out together. We can endure. Uh, so, in the mean, uh, you can't be serious. Right. Click. I don't know what it is. One is. There were things they told us of, uh, things without souls that walk in forgotten places, following orders from century ago. Don't linger in caves, uh, don't delve too deep. Could be Mothagi down there. Mothagi. Okay, I sometimes spoke kind words to the ma um, millstones and clocks in case they got any idea. <laughs> this Hilbert, by the way. Uh, the lady is uh, uh, Fion, Fion, Fionaria, Fionaria, Fionaria. Okay, cool. Uh, her night job was always our go-to threat growing up. Now that was a monster. Then, uh, and things in the dark can be left unseen. Okay, quirk. Until suddenly, they can't. Wow, this is like a mechanic, kind of like you know, monster, I guess. Wow, so Hubert and Fionaria. Fionaria. Run! Huh? It went off to the other side. <laughs> what on earth? Um, so what the... What was that? Um, we'll figure out later. So that is from Song. 
crack. Oh, these are the machines, um, you know. And uh, this isn't happening. It can't be. Hubert, grab whatever you can swing and come on. So now I choose uh, whether I want to, um, whether they would be uh, rivalry or friends or, or, or romance. I, I think as a tank, um, I think I'll, I'll put him into a friendship this time because last time I used to go for the romance. I'll just let the romance kind of develop on its own. Maybe the two girls should be romancing each other. I don't know. Uh, let's go for the uh, friendship here. Right there with you. Uh, you've... You think you've got this in you, uh, Hubert said. A song said to Hubert, uh, "Give me some credit. I can fight. I just never had a good reason. Let's see if we can get at them from multiple sides." So that's it. Uh, first thing is already a battle. Mm, okay, that is interesting. So all heroes plus one armor and warding. That's cool. As always, uh, there are two different kind of monsters. Just how one is a spectic and a familiar. Um, yeah, so there's a claw, and there is like a leg or whatever. Got, 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 or some kind of like you know stuff here. Now, um, I I think what we need to do, what we need to do is that um, there are a couple of things I can do. I can either song is over there, so I need to come by to uh, we need a group together, of course, as always. So let's start with song first. How far can she go? Hmm. I think she can go somewhere like here. Let's start with there. Okay, cool. And the uh, so now Hubert, where can Hubert go? I think Hubert can. Uh, there's no guard, huh? Hubert is so. Um, Hubert, where can Hubert go? Because there's no guard at all. Just strike or whatever. So I just like uh, let's do a. Uh, like let's chain up together. It's a wall of defense. So this one here is uh, Fiona. So I can uh, I can move to here. I can extinguish the light so that uh, it's better cover. Uh, that's all. So monster come attack the Hubert, and there's another monster coming as well. So I'll just shoot the one that is nearest because there's a percentage of uh, success there. I think I can just uh, quickly dispatch this one first. Ah, it's been dodged. Well, I mean, bear in mind that these are like, you know, really amateur, like farmers. Um, so this is a, uh, what on earth is Fionaria? Uh, she's supposed to be, um, oh, I thought she's like, a, uh, I thought she's like a, like a, like a, like a, like a, like a mage or whatever it is. Um, that is interesting. She doesn't really do much, does she? So I think she can go to this side and do an attack to this guy here. Done. So that's good. Well done. Teamwork. I thought I got a mage. Ooh, wow! That was uh, one damage up there. So let's shoot from here. That's cool. There's a damage there. I could move this guy here and do a strike. Let's do that. Done. So that is done. I need to kill off all the enemy. Oh, wow, that's a success. So that's easy. Let's see what story um, after that we have um, the stories. So uh, Hubert has grown stronger, so I can either do a Blood Rage, Black uh, Back Slam, or Star Wars. Um, well, none of them are really that fantastic, I would say. Uh, I think probably. I would go for the uh, Star Wars, um, Star Wars, because um, sometimes I just want the tank to stay where they are, without, without doing anything stupid. Um, so that is the um, my hunter. I could either have the uh, fault light, uh, fault flight, which is very important sometimes because uh, it does dodge attack. Um, when standing in place. Range have uh, by a blaze. Uh, man, these are none of them are really cool. I think I'll go for. I'll go for fo fox flights. Not great. Now it's a mist. Um, I can either do an um, um, myth weaver, 
which is uh, plus one potency per infused statue. Sometimes I can do more than one. Um, Fifty percent chance uh, reflect damage while infused. That is not bad. Uh, Lore dumb as well as the uh, greater construct uh, can infuse with one extra additional target, which is also very important. Um, so, wow, all these are pretty good stuff, I would say. The all these things are very good stuff. All these things are very good stuff, and. Um, Take damage for each one time is prevented and the object take. all these are pretty good stuff. I can do an additional one one target is also pretty good. Uh, because it gives me options in a, in a battlefield. So I'm really torn between these two, but I'll go for the open mind. Alright, cool. So I've got a a shield. <laughs> the uh, I'll just give it to uh, Hubert because he's my tank. Okay, cool. So that is a shield for him. That's done. So first order of business, we'll break these things down and hack up their parts. Second order door, uh, though, uh, we can't very well go back to the sweeping uh, Kumbh Song of this. Not when those things are still out there. Uh, Fionarius is right. Perhaps we are meant for this. Yeah, these are farmer, by the way. We will hunt them. We will find them. We'll take those splinter out of the world. We'll need a company name. So that is when there is a you can name the guild. Uh, pretty interesting. Okay, so a name that the people have been have like you can have like uh, the sisterhood of the sacred feast, the rascal of the conquer, the rebellion of the blushing south, south man. Or you can just create your own name as well. Uh, man, I mean, this not really a sisterhood. Um, maybe the rebel. Well, man, I mean, the rebellion of the blushing south sounds cool. There you go, rebellion of the blushing south. That is my uh, my guild name. So every time uh, the monster get level up as well. So you get level up, the monster get level up, and they kind of like you know add those card there. So it's a little bit of card games as well. So now I need to clear all the hostile site and locate a uh, uh, candle share forge. So the forge is over here, all right? And uh, I could recruit someone, and I really should recruit someone as well. Um, I need to locate here. So the forge. So I need to. This is the. This for scouting. This is a scouting. Um, this is another scouting area. Okay, so I've got like three scouting area before I get to here. Uh, the best thing to do is just get another uh, kind of like hero there. And I've got a new recruit, uh, which is a greedy poet. Let me just recruit him. Um, so the recruitment goes, you're back. I saw you leave a while ago. So they seem like, like good friends at Brock. Uh, I did, but it occurs to me that we'll need more help if we're going to have any kind of impact on the um, Mothagi. Okay, so are you interested? Uh, well, I mean these are cowards, man. I don't know what's going to happen. Um, but these are ever shifting. I should I should name my guild like you know, uh, a bunch of cowards or whatever. Perhaps this branch could see itself from um, a sphere. This sounds promising. I need a hunter. Uh, I think I need a hunter. What sort of skill I need the most? I'll train him as a hunter. I need some DPS. So I found that one tank, one 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 mage, and two hunters the best combination uh, so far. Things to be, and I need to prepare him as well. Okay. Great. So he's prepared for adventure, and um, mm, once per turn uh, is refunded an action point after melee kill every time. Kill an enemy, it um, enter Grey Plane for free. Uh, I think I'll go for Rook. We'll see. So these are the Great C, can't go there. And uh, I always find it quite useful to prepare defense as well because that is, um, you need to start thinking about defending your, your, your tile. Mm, uh, in case of an attack, you can use them to slow the enemies down. Uh, without you know casualty 
if you may. So now that is done, I may, because I need to work my way through here, so a little bit of like optimization here. The, uh, so I need to scout this area here. So let's just scout it. The whole party will go to scout the area. And uh, the enemy is getting stronger because they have the Calamity card. Okay, good. Now, after you scout the area, you can assault them or you can just try to clear the area first, but you can't. Mm, sometimes you can clear the infestation. If there's none, there's none. So it's time to assault them. Uh, let's go. Uh, let's assault this, um, this area. Attack. So, uh, what was the guy's name we were supposed to keep a night out for? Uh, Talari, I think. Talari. Some random event. From what I know of forest folks, they normally spread themselves out over the landscape. They find each other when they want to be found. These aren't exactly normal time though. Uh, and his wife seems concerned anyway. Of course she is. Uh, oh, T Talari seems distracted. Starts spending more and more time out in the ruin, watching the goat or... Or so he says, I'm concerned too. Is that the story? <laughs> Sometimes he wouldn't even come home at night. The lady seems at loss. Sounds like they need back the communication, I said. Alright, so they go over. And these are good friends, by the way. How do you get people to tell you these things? Uh, sit still for five minutes is all. People have all sorts of stuff twisted up inside. <laughs> Cloud grows like lichen over the sky. They pick their way through the building bones until a shot rings out from close by. Come on, come on. Up the hill, a man stands against a monument. Uh, he gazes darts between the sky. Come on. And the shadow of approaching a um, Mothagi. Wow. Another machine. So I think... <coughs> I can sneak in uh, while he got the attention. I think just get around him quickly. Uh, the rebellion of the blushing south rushes towards the monument. Alright, cool. We are there. We are there to save the day. So now... Um, oh, there's a stone spirit. You need to catch this guy. Okay, so this is important to catch and uh, I will use my tan to catch this guy. I may have something good. Yeah. So now he's thinking. Stone Spirit, are you afraid? Uh, are you alright, little one? Bree, bree. Um, so I can either have uh, I I either uh, enchant my axe so that I become a level one stone axe or a legacy point. I'll go for level one tier one stone axe. Yay, done. So now I've um, I've got uh, upgrade of damage by one point. Not a lot, but it's a good to like you know go. And I have like the the the, the property here called stone a stun effect. I shred one armor and pin all enemy within a two tile radius. So I claim it. Uh, it can change the name of the thing as well. So now uh, let's see. Um, I need to be able to regroup a little bit because the tank is out there. So uh, let me just uh, come to this part first uh, from the wall. And I would uh, see which one I would hit the best. So I'm going to hit this guy first. One damage, not that great. And uh, I've got this man here. Um, I can do. I can. What can I? Do? What can I do here? Hang on a second. I can do. Um, like you know, just wait here. There's no guardian. So, a like, mage in this game doesn't shoot fireball. But what you can do is they can infuse object to uh, to deal damage to the to the enemies there. So I can infuse. An object like this one here, and uh, and it is uh, two damage, two strat, and two pierce. Um, so I can in infuse that, and I can like um. Uh, but the problem is that now, okay, I can do a spin the bars, and I blast at three enemies at the same time. AOE stuff. This is good stuff. Yup. So we since strat them. AOE is always uh, always wonderful. So I'm going to have another person here. Um, if I do it here, I can only shoot one guy. If I do it here, I can shoot two guys. <clears throat> what should I do? Let's do one guy first. And I'll just shoot this guy here. Okay, good. By, by good luck, I've got like, you know. Um, yeah. Bone Link. I don't know what Bone Link is. Oh, wow. Took cover. See, this is the cover. It's good. It's, it's strategic game, right? So I need to somehow... Um, Okay, Guardian is uh, is a bit far far further than I, I I really wanted, so unfortunately the um, hmm, that is not very good. Um, so what I'll do, 
Let me see. I need to bring the tank up front somewhere. Let me just bring him up front first. All right, cool. That's my strategy. I can shoot this guy. All right, cool. And uh, I could also move to here and attack. Which I think will be good. Attack. Oh no, it's been blocked. Okay, now I can in I can I, I can infuse another object here. And uh, I can do disgust, which is one of the ability onto this guy 100 percent Right, done. Dispatched. The major powerful if you know what you're doing. Um so now I can see whether I should be able to shoot from here. There's a cover, so I go for cover and I shoot from here. Good, two damage. Okay, now the monster is coming to us. Okay, we took cover. Take two damage somewhere. Um, I my my tank can go and just tank it up, man. Yeah, man. Cool. I hope that's done. Well, it's it's pretty straightforward. Beginning of the game. Um, but always about making the right decision with the right timing as well. Don't linger too long on the certain things. So I found something that's tier one warrior armor. So I I I would um upgrade my tank. All right, cool. Uh, speed will drop. Armor will be up. Dodge will drop as well. Wow. Uh, let me think a little bit harder here. But the armor will, will, will go by one now. But I drop my speed. I drop my dodge. Um, hmm. ah, so, but it's a, it's a tier one. It's a tier one. But um, I... I I, I would drop quite a few things here, but I, oh man, what is plus one armor versus five dodge, man? I mean, it's a, it's, it's a hard kind of decision here. Um, I will salvage this as well. Uh, I don't think I need it. Um, so I've got the uh, ring of uh, uh, rhythm with speed. I think it is important to have the, uh, the hunter that has a speed. Which one would benefit the most? Um, maybe, maybe the hunter here. All right, cool. Claim it for him. The cloud begins to disperse, and song regards the man who is now rubbing his arms and staring at the ground. Uh, Telari, do I know you? Uh, your wife sent her regards. Um, okay. And the uh, so what's the story? Watching the goat. The goats do like it here. They climb the ruin. But that's not uh, when the forest begin to, to get more dangerous. I thought it may be time to finally use a storm well here. Huh? What is this? Surprised you haven't heard of it. Um, this thing's been on the family land forever. Aunt said it was uh, Hyorin. We had story that it could, uh, this is going to be sound crazy, but it could give you power. And my family are abysmal uh, storytellers, see? Terrible imagination, so I thought maybe they're not just a story. Maybe I could, you know, protect the goat. And my wife, my we, my uh, Ellie, if I could get a hold of that power, it take research and some old family recipes and time, lots of time to get a Stormwell to give up its secret. I didn't want to tell Ellie. Rather, she came up with a story of her own. <laughs> Uh, better than the story of a uh, go go hard trying to wear a hat too size too big for him. It's a shame though. I need um, I need maybe one more good storm. The cloud looked promising today, and I thought I could finish the process before the monster got here. No such luck. It was silly. Now that I've seen what fighting really is, uh, I'm not cut out for it. Glad I never told Ellie. So now you're going to count my goat and go home, yeah? Alright, cool. So this guy is going to leave unless one of you wants it. Alright, why not? It's possible. Make the beast pay good next time. The sky clearing now, but if you want to take me up on it, come back sometime. Ask for Tila, uh, Telari Constance, Ellie too. We'll fit you, put you up, give you our the worldly power, forest, fork, hospitality, you know. There you go. Cool. And uh, now the enemies are getting stronger, which is fine. Uh, okay, so now this part is uh, interesting. I want to check my armor again because I wasn't sure whether my decision was a good one or not. Um, 
because if I am to craft, say I'm I'm to craft something here, right? So if I were to craft something for say um, this guy here, right? I uh, know, sorry, the uh, Hubert, then yeah, so you know it would be much better choice. I think I should go for the uh, broad guard. No, so he's more of like a yeah. So I I would go for this one. I could build it like a tank, kind of six armor kind of thing. But um, I don't know. It could have been a this this choice here. Um, yeah, I, given another time, I may want to do it something differently. So now I could um, secure this place first, whereby I can just uh, you know have more kind of like um get one more item out from it. I hope. So every area that you secure, you will get um, more material at the end of the the, the, the chapter. There are five chapters in general. You got a belt as well for dodge. So who needs a dodge mo most? 60, 60, 55. So it's either Hubert or Fionaria. So I, I'll give it to Hub. Okay, uh, Hubert. Now you could also, um, there are two events here. Either you secure, prepare defense or do the do the storm storm well because the the incursion is not there yet so i'll, I'll go ahead with the storm well it's one of the like half like a story so i need to choose a hero from the list to uh, to get the power um the uh that is interesting who should i choose though i will choose a mage all right and meanwhile the rest of the people can defense, prepare defense. All right. So me, meanwhile, you can multitask this game. So okay. So the uh, Telari and Ellie welcome Fion Fion Fionaria and stuff her full of uh, 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 Bristol berry pie and goat cheese while they waited for a storm to roll in. Right. This is more like it. Ellie, get your boot. You stay. Right. But she's a coward. Uh, Telari, tinker with the top of the storm well. Careful. Well, there's a wife, by the way, Ellie. And there is a rumble. Wonderful. Good sign. Almost there. You call us when you're ready. All right, cool. Brum. Uh, so, what, do you, what would you give up? Huh? For? For the whole thing, heroing, <laughs> heroing. Uh, you know, like your goat or your spouse to name example at random. Oh, okay. For a while, I thought I gave up security, but then I realized that if things are this bad, maybe security was an illusion. Not that I mean. I mean, this place is safe for now anyway. Wait, is that what you ask? There's another Fionaria out there in a different time who may be got some goat and a husband maybe she was happy um, I'll never know her story but this one's mine F Fionaria's musing a sharply interrupted crack alright uh, Talari Whoop. what? there's some magic power it's been a long flower to bloom but it is quite pretty now isn't it? Uh, the storm well fills with light or water or both is swirled and spill over the side. I should have asked this before, but am I going to have to fight something? Probably not. What happened now then? Uh, that wasn't in the stories. The ancient voices of the tempest aren't telling you. So you either... Wow, this is cool. I can transform my head. I can transform my arm. I can transform a lick. You know what? I mean, you know, this may sound crazy. I'll go for the head. Because I've done the arm, I've done the leg kind of thing. Well, I've done the head. Well, let's do a head. Let's go for a head. F <laughs> Fionaria. But she looks quite pretty, by the way. Fionaria draws her face close to the water. Tiny flashes within it hold her gaze. Suddenly, it's obvious what she's supposed to do. Oh no! How did it taste? A bit metallic, not great, honestly. Um, you both okay? Cool. 
So now if I look at her, she's got a little bit of a thing on her head here. Uh, what it means is that she has a new ability called the Storm Gaze. That uh, incoming melee damage has 30% chance to deal 2 true damage to the attacker. So that is her ability. And you can see a story here as well. That um, you know she has, uh, she has gained power from a, a Gothard ancient storm well. Yeah, cool. So yeah, I mean that is really cool. And uh, meanwhile, I could also, um, what what defense is it? Tier one, is it? So I can ask her to scout this area as well. I mean, you know, since two three of them are working here. Okay, okay, these are monsters. Let's go. A bit of divide and conquer. So I need to gather. Um, I need to. Like you know, all this. Travel. I I still haven't quite figured out all heroes on this tile travel to a safe tile. So I I can I travel to here. No, I can't. I have to let it scout first. Okay, and then this area, you patrol. You can patrol to clear all this, like, you know, um, uh, infestation. So I'll do a patrol, but I'll cool all the people together. So that's the, the gameplay here, all right? It's getting a bit dark outside. I'm not sure how the camera is. My apologies if my face looks too dark. But uh, it's, it's a storm out there. Um, and it's actually still kind of early-ish, I would say. It's only about 6 uh, p.m. Singapore time. All right, cool. Um, so we have, uh, we, have, we have cleared the infestation. So we had assault. Okay, one more assault, and I'll just like, you know, finish the video for you guys. A uh, wild, thriving old local was happy to provide lowdown on his weird tower. What is she telling you, a Brock? Any clue who built the place? Uh, didn't say, just talk about bone walkers, roll the woods sometimes, leather face guy over on the other hill said light leaks from the crack of these old stones just on fortnight, he said since last year. Uh, well, that's what uh, we've expected, I suppose you're ready to go. Bam! Wow. Dust drift in sudden, empty doorway, guess it's open. Uh, do you really, do you really have to kick it down? <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, try in that hall, uh, I've got a peek downstairs, a brook. Uh, soon, a buzz from the hall far and sneak into their ear. Alright. That noise coming from inside, yeah, something's, uh, bam! Wow, some magic happening. Seriously, need to stop. It's just so satisfying, she just keeps crashing all the doors. As they enter, the noise abates. Oily odor, uh, odor spill off a uh, shadow crowded shelf, shaped organic to synthetic by varying uh, degrees, spread and pile everything in industrial disarray. disarray. Nothing of actual any actual value by the look of it, a lot of trial and error it looks like. If it's working, um, Morthagi's machinery, it may be time to test this thing as I was saying. Not this again, Herbert. Hubert. Uh, seems like we should give it a shot though. What if we activate our own Mothagi and it lights us? Maybe peace comes that way. <laughs> Cell is empty. What do you do find? Huh, you can't be serious. Uh, Hubert wants to try his theory. This. So, either you torch the whole room up, blast this their plant up, as one nearly finished, just near dead. Uh, dismantle it, search for what's useful. Um, I think I'm just, I'm a sentimental type, you know, let's just find it. Um, so Hub Hubert settled in to fiddle with the half-finished uh, contra contraption line there among the scrap. Uh, so look, I understand I'm not the one you're thinking of when it comes to tinkering and book studying and such, but I'll tell you, these are wonder of the ancient world. I feel drawn to their hidden stories like it was destiny. You talk about an awful lot. Yeah, I don't know, it's just been a hobby of mine. How much time should we give him, you think? I would say we are close to the limit. Why isn't this working? A little core is secure, right? Come on. Uh, ooh. Okay, see if this gets you going. Poke. Okay, I think there's some blood there. Uh, 
Brrr. So, Hubert, how much longer until... Oh, I think we finished. Oh, there's a, there's a little monster here. Eric, what is it? Don't don't let it... Okay, um... He considered you as a friend. Why? You think so? <laughs> Maybe inherited my feelings through the blood, perhaps? Uh, so this uh, his son. Son. Alright, cool. Uh, let's uh, hope he remember whose side it is on. <laughs> Funny. Whoa, some malaria joins the party. Hubert has taken in a companion which will help in any battles he takes part in. Fantastic, so I've got like a new companion here. Okay, so uh, but a lot nausea. Uh, lose one hit point because I think there was some stuff going on here. So I've got this monster here that can do something. Oh, can do like, oh, I don't know what I can do. And uh, let's see, I'm going to come here. And I'm just going to open the door, reveal some monster, and we guard the place. I'm going to come here and see whether I can shoot something or not. I can't. Okay, so I'm just going to and the, uh, come here. And I can't shoot anything, so I'm going to... Um, just going to... Okay, so I'm just going to hit in here. Hide myself there. I got this little monster who can also shoot. Um, so I'll stand behind my daddy, or on the side of my daddy. Alright, I can wait. Okay, now I need to do a bit of like, um, you know, from my experience, it's always good to, okay, I infuse this guy here. Okay, I can, um, okay, so I just uh, wait here. So I would come to behind my tank and later on I'll shoot if I need to. Done. Okay, let's see. Alright, so there are a couple of monsters here. What's that? Right. Oh no, there's damage there. Okay, so I've got the uh, Guardian there. Oh no. Now, at this rate, right, it is important to, uh, to, to know... Uh, oh no, I clicked the wrong button, haven't I? That is really stupid on my... Uh, let me come back to here. Um, I had wasted opportunity. I clicked the wrong button. So I need to shoot this guy. Somehow I clicked the wrong thing. Okay, I um, this guy here is my machine. I'm not going to do anything here, stupid. I'm just going to maybe just come here first. I'm done. And uh, I'm going to flare this guy up. Blinded. I have to be careful with uh, Fionaria. Um, so I think Okay, one here. I could start moving forward, I think. Oh it dodged. I would need to carve like Oh man, this is a bit tough. Uh let's see. I'm not keen to get her out. Of, uh, of of uh, of things because that is okay, let's do a forge here let's just do this one first done done okay very good okay let's see now I can like um pair up with this guy and uh and side by side and do a shoot from here sixty six percent not too bad mm, I can also come here. But this machinery can't shoot anything, huh? Because it's the range is very low. Done. Let's see, two groups here. Hmm. Okay. So let's just pursue. Wow, this is like a pretty cool machine, man. Um, I could come over here and uh, do a Oh, blocked. No good, no good. Um, let's see. How many percentage do I do that? Let's see. Okay, 
Okay, let me see. Let's if I go here uh, in a second, I need to somehow be able to I uh, run off uh, run out of Let me just guardian. Shoot this guy. Okay, so my pet need to So that's done. Hope that's it. Uh, a bit of risk here and there. The the pet can't really be level up, can it? Yeah. Fantastic. So I've got the uh, necklace of uh, uh, chivalry, which is a uh, plus point five armor. So I think I'll give it to um, the tank. I would say armor is important. Although this lady also needs some armor. Um, hard choice. Maybe this one first. Claim me for this lady, and uh, that's it. Yeah. Then after that, the story rule, um, and then you know same thing. Secure. Defense and move on next one next one and then go for this one But the incursion is coming as well. So it's getting more exciting and uh, the, the objective is really to come to this point here But you have to clear all the hostile site and locate this fort and then move on to the next chapter So I hope you enjoy this uh, short uh, kind of like you know, it's not really short But you know the, the very beginning part of this uh, this chapter probably will take about an hour or so to complete this chapter So I'm not going to continue this in this video But um, you know if you haven't really got a chance to play this game man, this is really one of the best game I've played so far So much fun. All right. See you next time Goodbye